do you want? No, this is your clutch. I know where the clutch is. Right, do you want me to show you how to do this or not? Yes, but I know where the clutch is. Okay, fine. All right, you do it yourself, okay? Fine. Hey, hey, hey! What are you doing? You can't park here. Uh, I'm just here to pick it's up private Sarah property. Wh now turn around, get the hell out of here. Come on. Okay. Move it. Yep. Uh, uh, okay, uh, you know what, though? I think I'm just gonna wait right here. You can go back to doing your guard the cornfields thing. This is Officer Moore at the gate. We got an issue here. <laughs> hey, listen, asshole. This is a restricted area. I told you, get the hell out of here. Okay. Hey, hey, you just wait right there. I told you. Move it. It's like I was trying to say, I'm just here you to pick up... Did you not see that sign? Oh, look at that. That's kind of hard to miss. I'm authorized to use deadly force. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Hey, hey, whoa, hey, whoa, whoa, what's going on? <laughs> I'm sorry, Miss Whitaker. It's, it's what, fine, I, Do you know this asshole? Yeah, he's with me. He's with me. Sorry, ma'am. I, I on, didn't know go. that... It's fine. Honestly, I apologize. Shh. Oh, and Jim... Deacon. I'm not with her. She's with me. Hold on tight. Why do you always do that? Do what? Act like such a dick. Oh, come on. He started it. What are you, five? Hey, watch the clutch. Remember, you gotta give it enough gas, rev up the RPMs. I got this. Yeah, I've been here. Where are we headed? Over to the dam. That's a nice, quiet road, right? Were you driving? No. Are we still going out tonight? You said something might come up. Uh, crap, yeah. Uh, Boozer and the boys want to ride down to Klamath State, visit Jack. So you're gonna blow me off to go see some guy in prison? Jack's not some guy. I know, I know. I was kidding. Every time I'm on a bike with you, some idiot in a truck tries to run us off the road. Oh, my God. No, no, no. no. Listen, listen, listen. You did great. You did great. Uh, most people, they would have panicked. They would have oversteered, and that would have gotten us killed. I almost did get us killed. I was... No, no. I wasn't paying attention, and I was distracted. Hey, it's okay. It's okay. Just breathe. You're okay. Wait a second. What did, what did you mean, distracted? No, it's just stuff going on at work. It's nothing. I just... Oh. Okay. Oh, I just thought maybe you uh, saw my new patch. Your what? No. No, Matt? Wait, you, you quit the club? No, I didn't quit the club. I would never quit the club. Uh, uh, nomad, what it means is, um, well, I'll be less involved from now on. Deke, I didn't ask you to do that. Oh, I know, I know. And if you had, I would have said no. <laughs> you ready to try this again? Yeah, I mean, no, but yeah, I will. Thank you for saving my life. <laughs> well, you know, I do what I can. Hey, hey, the clutch, the clutch. I know what the clutch is. Okay, no, no, the... Deacon. So, uh, do you think your parents are gonna come? To the wedding? I don't know. I mean, you know, I, I thought if I stepped back from the MC that, uh... I don't think it's gonna matter to them, Deacon. But you're gonna, you're gonna at least tell them. Yeah, if you want me to. Look, it's just... I'm not going to change who I am and who you are. 
to make my uptight, middle-class parents happy. Okay. Look out! I see them. Hey, are they... are they headed to your work? Oh, shit. What about the MC? Are any of them coming now that you've gone nomad? Oh, uh, I don't know. Uh... It's probably been a while since any of them set foot in a chapel. Uh, and you really want 27 Harleys rolling up in that little church in Marion Forks? Yeah. You know what? As a matter of fact, I do. Uh, okay. What's going on? Uh, I don't know. Miss Whitaker. Yeah. Chief's been trying to get a hold of you. Says it's urgent. It's always urgent. Let him know I'll be right there. Okay. I gotta go. Hey, hey. <sighs> Sorry. It's fine. It's probably just a fire alarm or something small. Okay. How come dead? <clears throat> Love you. Um, just call me later. I'm sorry. What if? Addy, whatever, Ricky. I'm sorry. God damn. Clearance. Clearance. Uh, O'Brien, this is St. John. Come back. O'Brien, this is St. Just answer your goddamn radio! St. John, I didn't think I'd hear from you again. Yeah, neither did I. All right, listen, that night you bugged out. You told me that you didn't take any civilians. You just took, uh, Nero personnel, feds, people with clearance. I told you. Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up. Listen to me. Sarah, my wife, she had clearance. She had her ID badge with her the night that I put her on your chopper. I so don't think that just do me a favor, look it up. Sarah Irene Whitaker. She worked at Cloverdale. She had federal clearance. She was doing, uh, I don't know, research, pharmaceutical. I don't know what she, the hell she was okay, doing. Just okay. do me. I'll see what I can find. Okay, great. O'Brien, well, remember, you owe me. Yeah, yeah. O'Brien oh, out.